Good morning friends and Shabbat Shalom here on this fantastic Thursday morning live from Bet Shemesh. This week it is going to be called Shabbat Shuva. Naturally it's going to be Parshat Vayelech. Usually they're together with Nitzavim every year but this year it's by itself respectively Parshat Vayelech. And we are entering the last mitzvot inside the Torah and it is none other than the mitzvah of Hakel. What is this? This occurs every seven years at the time of Sukkot on uh, the second day of Sukkot, which was uh, respectively on the 16th of Tishrei, where all the Jews will get together of all ages and ascend together towards a better Mikdash. And the king, the Melech of, uh, of the na Jewish nation, would read from his own Sefer Torah, different extracts of the Torah itself respectively, in an all-awakening uh, Teshuva procession, where all of Am Yisrael unite. They, there's a tremendous achdut, unity, among all of Am Yisrael. This happens every seven years and occurs at the culmination of the Shemitah period. Why is it such a unity festival? Because it's gathering the people together on the Sabbath of the years. Every seven years it is a Shemitah, or, uh, known as the Sabbath, the resting of the land. And also at this stage in time, all different loans and everything else is nullified at that stage in time and where we dwell inside the Sukkots, inside the Sukkahs and we get away from our material possessions, from our grand houses, whatever it might be. We might have people with mansions or people with tiny apartments, but they'll all stay inside the Sukkah together, inside a, a more earthly uh, procession. And this happens fittingly on the festival of Sukkot, where we uh, gather the Arbat Aminim together, which represents the four different kinds of Jews. And the symbol of Hakel, this mitzvah of gathering the Jewish people together, is to bring unity among Am Yisrael. And uh, none other than on Sukkot, where it's a time of the Anniah Kavod, the clouds of glory, hovering over Israel during the Midbar. And uh, it's an interesting thing. It's a phenomenal mitzvah, and it's done none other by the king. Here we are, we're coming in the time in, in the United Kingdom, the Commonwealth at the moment. We've got King Charles has just uh, been, obviously, after the queen had sadly passed away, is now the natural king of the United Kingdom. And uh, that was a mitzvah of the king every seven years of Israel to gather the people together, do teshuva, and uh, to do this all awakening experience. And it's no coincidence that Parshat Vayekel actually comes at the time just before Yom Kippur, which is the most significant time of re repentance throughout the whole years. Guys, I want to wish you well over the fast. And Bezrashem, we're going to have an awesome Shabbat. Shabbat Shalom Uvrach, guys. Bye.